Well, Dr. Bernard Gallagher is a child protection expert. I asked him if there was no proof of abuse, why can't social services remove the allegations from their files? A lot of people would think naturally that the information should be uh, deleted, but there is an, ex an expectation upon agencies involved in child protection to actually retain information uh, because it might be that there's concerns in the future and when they're put together with the previous concerns that uh, you know agencies uh, uh, realize they've got more need to actually intervene. But, 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 but why when a couple have done absolutely nothing wrong do they ne still need to be held there? Well I think if it could be shown you know absolutely lately beyond doubt that uh, the parents concerned had done no wrong then I could, I could see, you know, uh, as a principle, that information should be deleted. But I think the problem is that um, unless, you know, we have access to all the information on the particular case, it's actually difficult to make that judgment. And Very. it might be that agencies had other concerns we're not aware of. The University of Huddersfield, inspiring tomorrow's professionals.